American F-16 fighter jets set for Ukraine are making their way to training centers in the United States and Europe, as Kyiv's allies hope the modern warplane can push Russian jets further from the front lines and change the shape of the battlefield from the air. The F-16 will replace Ukraine's strained and thinning fleet of the Soviet-designed MiG-29s and other jets dated back to days of the Cold War. They have advanced radar and their weapons boast greater range and may allow Ukraine to better Russian air defense systems. Western military officials and experts also say the F-16s will help Kyiv integrate with Western allies and break Ukraine's reliance on aging hardware built by its enemy. Training enough pilots and support crew to operate the new fleet will take months. Eight pilots and 65 support personnel are in the first stages of learning how to operate the F-16 in Denmark. Others are in Arizona and Romania. Although the exact number of aircraft has not been disclosed, experts expect it to be in the dozens. Kelly Greco, a senior fellow at the Stimson Center, adds that air combat training would be next, with six to eight weeks of instruction. Air-to-ground training would last another two months. A Ukraine Air Force spokesperson said he did not expect the jets to operate in Ukraine until 2024. Russia has warned against delivering F-16s to Ukraine, with its ambassador to Denmark saying in August that doing so would be, quote, an escalation of the conflict.